uh, welcome to this tutorial. In this section, I just want to give you an overview of the interface in case uh, you haven't used Unity in a while or in case you just want to discover it. So I've just created a brand new scene. And in this scene, basically, you can see different views and windows and tabs. So the first one is called the hierarchy. So again, the hierarchy will be listing all the different objects available in the scene. So again, it will be on the left hand side. You can see I've got a main camera here and I've got a directional light there as well. Again, whenever I click on one of those objects on the right hand side, I will have more information about the actual objects that I have just selected. In our case, you can see that it is a directional light. And again, we have information about the transform, so position, location, so rotation, scale, and also the light as well in terms of color and intensity. So again, this is the inspector on the right hand side that will give you more information about the object that is currently selected. And on the left hand side, you have the hierarchy view. In the middle here, you have what is called a scene view. The scene view will provide a visual representation of your scene. So again, whenever you select an object in the hierarchy view, your object will be represented and displayed in the scene view. So again, if I click on the light, you can see that it is represented right here. And the same for the camera. Again, you have the choice between two modes, 2D and 3D. Okay, and the, TD, the 2D mode is usually employed uh, whenever you are crea creating a 2D game or whenever you are working on the user interface for your game. Just know that you have several tabs that you can switch uh, between. So again, you have the game view, which will give you the game viewed from the camera and the asset store, which is basically an online store from where you can download assets. Some of them are free and some of them are premium. Again, to complete this overview, we have the um, project view here. In the project view, you have several things. The first thing is you have uh, different um, assets and different folders. In my case, again, you have a folder called assets with a load of different objects. So again, this is part of the startup pack whenever and you have in this pack uh, a folder or a project that is uh, to be used uh, for these tutorials. So again, you have the project view here that will list all the assets present in your uh, project. Just note that in the project you can create different scenes and all these scenes will be uh, will have access to the assets that are uh, present in your project. So again, this is your project view. And here we have what is called the console window. I'm going to clear it for now. And again, the console window is basically there to display messages, some of them from Unity, that will tell you whether there is an error in your script or from yourself if you create a script and in this script you write code that is supposed to display information in the console window, then this message will be displayed in the console window. So that's it for the overview. And the last bit, I suppose, is you have different type of buttons here, a play button and a pause button. So again, whenever you're going to play your scene, you're going to press on the play button. If you want to stop it, you're going to press on this button again. These four buttons here are, again, whenever you will be manipula manipulating object in your scene. Again, this is to pan the view, move object, rotate object, and scale your object. So that's it. I hope this is clear. In the next section, we'll start to look at creating our first script.